morning or I'm after high school. Hey, Chloe, what have you done with the with the place? I clothified it. Uh thank you. That's better. Uh by the way, what are you doing here? I'm back. The dynamic duo is back, everybody! Yes! Alright, time for joke of the day, guys. What has three sides, comes in a couple of different flavors, is completely tasty, and on sale today in the old school store what by the it? office. I, what is it? Samosas! Hump day! <laughs> Alright guys, so come on out to your school old school store by the gym. A dollar fifty for one, three seventy-five for three for hump day samosas, part of the Bring Bluey Home campaign. We'll see you guys all there. Alright, we'll see you there guys. Also, Miss Belleville and Mrs. Kavanaugh are looking for three young men and three young women from grades 10 to 11 to go to a Making Waves workshop on the weekend of November 15th to the 17th. The conference is about dating and violence prevention. We will be learning about what a good healthy relationship looks like and what an unhealthy relationship looks like. The Making Waves Committee is guided by the principles of equality, equity, and diversity. If you would like to come become an active partner in creating a world in which violence is not tolerated, you can pick up an application form at the office. Application forms are due to the office no later than 12.30 on Monday, October 21st. Let's get ready to make some waves at OHS. Alright guys, there will be a meeting for the first aid service team today at 11.50 in Mr. McLeod's room, 144. All members are asked to attend and, as always, new members are welcome. Alright, we'll see you there guys. Also, um, i just seen this on the desk. October 21st from 6 to 8 p.m. You can register by October 16th for your Youth and Social Media Safety Workshop. So this is hosted by MFRC. The cost is $5 per participant and the phone number is 422-3352 if you're interested. And it's open to youth as well as parents. Okay, so pour vous qui parlez français, votre atelier jeunesse sur la sécurité des médias sociaux, c'est du 21 octobre de 6h à 8h du soirée. Inscription pour le 16 octobre. Coût c'est 5 dollars par personne, puis c'est 4, 2, 2, 3, 3, 5, 2. C'est ouvert aux jeunes et à leurs parents. So I'll see you guys there. All right. Also, um, UNB Fredericton will be hosting a parent student night on Wednesday, October 16th at 7 p.m. at the Woo Conference Center. So be sure to be there. All right. The session will feature a presentation and a chance to talk with representatives about admissions, scholarships, student life, and more. Interested students can have can even have their application assessed on the spot. So that's Wednesday, October 16th at 7 p.m. Don't miss out on this opportunity, guys. Also, Remembrance Day Choir will be asked to work in Miss Bishop's room at lunch, so we'll see you at noon. I give a big shout out to my buddy Tyler Cummings. He came up to me today and gave me a big old hug in the morning and just started the day off right. So thanks. I'd like to say thank you to the person who put my books back in my book bag when I was coming back from Mr. Jackson's room in my AP class. Um, I'd like to say thank you to everyone that holds doors and just say, like says kind stuff to people in the hallway. So thank you. I have selected the winner for the next praise slip, and this one goes to the nominee is Ben McNeil, and it, he was nominated by Vicky Forbes. So she said there was kids throwing rocks at seagulls, and he had spoken up and asked them to stop. So thank you very, very much, Ben, for doing that. That's really kind of you. So both of you will get a free dance pass, as well as a free pizza pizza and a drink at the next dance coming up. So we'll see you there. Congratulations. You can stop me in the hallway to get your prize. Reminder to all Quit for Life participants that there is a meeting tomorrow during AP period in the library and we'll see you there tomorrow. Did you know that in 2010, 64% of New Brunswick girls aged 12 to 19 are moderately active or active during their leisure time and boys were 74%? Tomorrow, during lunch in the gym, we will be hosting our first yoga session in celebration of the International Day of the Girl. This is open to all students, not just girls, so come try something new and bring a friend. Door prizes will be given out, so I'll see you guys all there. I know, I'm going to check out some yoga. I'm definitely going. That's going to be awesome. All right, we'll see you guys there. Also, do you want to be a part of a group that makes a difference? Do you want your voice to be heard and shared, and your ideas to be shared? If you said yes to these questions, come check out our new girl group starting this Friday, October 18th at lunch in Ms. Kavanaugh's room, room 196. This group is being facilitated by our very own UMB nursing students, and we'll see you Friday. I know if I was a girl, I'd be there. Yeah, I'm going. Right. <laughs> Did you know that one of the best ways to prevent the spread of the flu is to wash your hands frequently, 
20 seconds of hand washing helps remove bacteria and viruses. If you don't have access to a bathroom to wash your hands, use hand sanitizers. Here at OHS, we have hand sanitizer pumps by Jim and the Four Corners. All right, and the Gaming and Animation Institute of Fredericton, 348 King Street, is hosting an open house this Saturday, October 19th at noon. Guest speaker is animator Wes Bryan. For more information, please call 450-4243, and we'll right. see you there. You stay classy, you're welcome to high school. Have a great day. Have a great day, everyone.